Okay, today I'm going to show you how to use a photograph as a shortcut to your storyboard. I took this shot of a barbershop off the internet, uh, but you know it's a lot of more effective if you can actually shoot the location you're going to go to. Uh, I want someone to sit, you know, in the chair, and so if I just put a character sitting, they're going to look, uh, let's say, kind of at the same angle as the chair and I zoom him down. It doesn't look like he's really sitting in the chair because he's on the photograph. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to mask the part of his body that we couldn't see from this angle if he was actually sitting in the chair. So to do that I go to Object, I'm sorry, Effects, Custom Effect and say yes and then I take the masking tool and I cut, let me take his opacity down so I can see the chair. So if I cut the along his body along the chair, let's do it in two, two, two different, see I'm dragging along the chair that is blocking our view of whatever a we couldn't see from this angle. So we're actually cutting out the pieces of his body. Each time I draw a mask, it, it shows as a different color, and so I can always right-click and remove that mask if I want to do something over again. Click Update. Oops, I forgot to change his opacity back to full opacity. Click Update. And so now he looks like he's sitting in the chair, even though he's not. So. That's how you can mask characters and objects into a photo as a good shortcut. Mm -hmm.